Hey, where are we? Are we going to the dog bakery? Yeah. <laughs> We're going to the bakery. Today I took Bear to downtown Bentonville so we could visit the dog bakery. He'd never walked in a downtown environment before, so he wasn't used to traffic, wasn't used to full sidewalks, but I think he did pretty well for his first go. Um, Aussies, they love stimulation, they love new things, they love being challenged, they like learning, and this was a great way for him to get a little bit of that while still having a fun outing. I think she sees her friend. <laughs> Look at the toys, come on. Oh, see a friend. What do we get? get? A bunch of stuff. Yeah, we'll try some later. <laughs> well, we couldn't film very much in the dog bakery because somebody was a little too excited. But that's okay. That's the first time he's been actually in a downtown environment. Normally we've just been hiking at the park. Um, so it was a big change as far as stimulation goes and as far as practicing his, his attention, practicing his attention. Um, but it was a good experience. It was good practice for him. And he eventually did start to calm down a little bit. Um, it was super exciting to see all these new dogs and to smell all these treats. <laughs> so um, yeah, but we'll, uh, we'll get there. We'll get the hang of it. Our next stop was the Crystal Bridges Museum of American Art. I've been waiting to take Bear here. I knew he would love it. There are hiking trails, there are paved trails, there's art along the pathways. So many things to explore. I knew he would have a blast here and the weather was perfect. Lots of sunshine, not too much wind. The day didn't disappoint. I know, probably somebody else's peed there. Hiking is one of our absolute favorite things to do. I love taking Bear on hikes. I love exploring my state with him. There's just so many things that you can teach your dog while you take them on a hike, but it's also a unique bonding experience. You're both getting to enjoy the outdoors. You're both getting to experience new things. It's play with your dog, um, and I highly recommend it. If you have hiking trails near you, take advantage of them. Get outside. Your dog will love it. The exercise will help both you and your pet stay healthy, and um, you might find some new places in your neighborhood that you absolutely love. Yeah. What do you smell? Come on, let's go find some art. <laughs> oh, you want to go see that? You want to go see the pig? You want to go see it? You want to go see the pig? We are in hog country. You want to? Come on. One of the reasons I adopted Bear was to have a friend to take with me on adventures. This is one of the things that I love about this little guy. He gets excited about new things, he loves to explore, and he's always up for something. That's exactly how I am, and I love having him with me when I go and do new things. It just makes the day even more fun. It makes me even more excited about getting out and doing something when I otherwise might decide just to stay at home. I strongly recommend having a dog to take with you um, when you're exploring new things, but 
Also, don't be afraid to take your new puppy on adventures. Yeah, they're going to act out. Yeah, they're not going to always behave and it's going to take more energy for me to do it. But you'll be so glad that you did and in the long run, your dog will get used to accompanying you on all kinds of adventures and it'll be a bonding experience for the both of you. Hiking was of course fun, but I think Bear's favorite part of the day was enjoying the cookie we picked out from the dog bakery.